Hello and welcome to Sky Ridge. My name is Melanie Lisey. I'm the director here on third floor. Nice to meet you. And my name is Wendy Fling. I'm the manager here on the third floor at Sky Ridge. And we went to, wanted to take the next couple of minutes to introduce ourselves, who we are as nurse leaders on this floor, and how we can be advocates for you while you're here and your families at home. One of the first things I wanna talk about regarding expectations as a COVID patient while you're with us is about oxygen. One of the main reasons people are here with us is because they're requiring higher levels of oxygen than they normally need. So I wanted to just briefly explain that depending on what level of oxygen you need, which we'll be monitoring you with a little probe on your finger at all times, will determine what type of oxygen delivery system you're gonna get. You might see a normal nasal cannula, you might use a heated high flow oxygen cannula that can give you a little bit higher oxygen needs or possibly even a BiPAP just to give you the support that you are requiring in that moment. And your respiratory therapist, your nurse and physician are all gonna be working together to make sure that we've got just what you need and they're gonna be explaining to you how they work. The next thing we wanna to talk to you is about physical safety while you're here. One thing that Wendy had mentioned is that your oxygen can drop quickly, um, creating things that would normally be easy day-to-day -day things that you do as a risk for your safety. One thing that we have in place is the bed alarm for our fall risk patients, and that's just to alert you and your team that you are needing assistance to get out of bed, a reminder that you are needing assistance prior to getting out of bed, and ultimately keeping you safe while you're here. One last thing that I would love to speak to you about is our hygiene protocols when you're in the hospital. We understand how important it is for you to be able to get up and get into the restroom, take a shower, and just feel clean every day. It's been hard with COVID because like Melanie mentioned, when you exert yourself, a lot of time those oxygen levels make you a lot weaker and put you at risk for an injury while you're with us. So we just like to let you know, we'll be working with your nurse and your respiratory team to make sure that they feel, if they feel safe for you to get in the shower, that we're gonna do everything we can to get that for you in a safe fashion. And if not, we'll do everything we can at the bedside. We're really good at doing bedside baths, getting you all the things you need to get cleaned up and make sure that you're still feeling taken care of in that way. To our families and friends of patients, we know how important it is to keep you connected as much as possible during all of the visitor restrictions that we currently have in the hospital for patient and family safety. Some things that we've come up with to make sure that you're remaining connected and that you can help with. Wendy, do you wanna share a couple? Absolutely. We live in the age of technology and it's been a great modality for us to use during COVID. One of the first things that we ask people when they come to the hospital is, do you have your cell phone and your phone charger? It comes in super handy. It's a great way if you're able for you to in real time, reach out and FaceTime with your family and friends or to be able to call them as you need to. One of the other things that we really encourage is that your loved ones can come, although they can't visit, they can bring your own personal items from home. If you have special food requests that you would like, your favorite pillow or a blanket is always a nice comfort to have with you as well. And if you have anything that you would love, um, let us know, reach out to your nurse. We wanna make sure that we're accommodating anything that we can do to make your stay feel more comfortable or for you to feel not so isolated as a patient. The other thing that we have in place also is some larger iPads mm -hmm. so that if you wanted to do a, f a photo conference with your family, if you don't have a cell phone or a way to do that, let your nurse know we are more than happy and we love to reconnect our family and friends with our patients during this time. And it's very easy to do and we can talk to your family member on how to get hooked up on their end. As nurse leaders here at Sky Ridge, we have been taking care of COVID patients for the last 18 months, and we want you to rest assured that you're gonna receive the best quality care that you can. We have discharged over a thousand patients who've had COVID, and it's really uh, an honor for us to get to take care of you in this scary time and set you up for success to get you out of the hospital and back to your family. We want you to know that we have nurse leaders here 24-7 to care for you and to communicate with your families. 
please rest assured that if there's any status changes with your loved one or you as a patient, we will reach out to your family um, with your permission to give them an update as to what's going on. Thank you so much for letting us care for you here at Sky Ridge. Like Wendy mentioned, we are very proud of the team and all of the patients that we've successfully discharged with COVID.